Well, our Redbird simulators are uh, FAA approved simulators that we use for student training. Uh, it's a good uh, way for them to learn procedures and things before getting in the airplane. Um, and you can pause and talk about it and uh, it's full motion, so they get a little bit of that as well. It's been really good. I mean, obviously I just started you know, this is the first time I haven't flown an airplane. I've been the same one time before this, so. Some of the things are touchy, but I've got a great instructor, Kylie, and she's talking me through everything. She demonstrates it to me, and then I do it, and I nail it. My name is Luke Frazier. I am from Orlando, originally. I've lived all over. I've lived in Atlanta. I've lived in New York, St. Louis, Kelowna, now Dallas. And uh, this is my favorite place by far. Great weather. I really love it here. Oh, what got interested with me interested in uh, flying planes was my brother actually went to a school right down the street here and uh, you know it looked awesome. He showed me videos and pictures and everything, but he said that school, you know, I guess it's not like the best one. He, he talked about this one, he said uh, this is the one you should go to. I looked into it and it's been great so far. Well, we use our Redbirds primarily for uh, introduction to each rating. So private, they're going to start in the simulator to kind of understand basics about an airplane. What does a throttle do? What just happens when I push on the rudder pedal? that kind of stuff so they're a little bit more comfortable before their first step in an airplane they're a little bit overwhelmed at that point uh, also with instrument kind of introducing some really basic instrument procedures before going on an airplane to kind of save a little bit of time and to kind of introduce those procedures so that they're more comfortable when, once they get in the airplane it's been really challenging but everyone's been supportive they've been helping me learn the materials and um, the simulator has been super fun so I've been enjoying it so we use our Redbirds primarily uh, to introduce each rating or certificate level to a student. So when they first start private, we put them in the simulators, especially in our ZTA program, to really uh, you know, save a little bit of time to just kind of knock off some of the basic things. Like what does a throttle do? What happens when I push on the rudder pedals? Things like that. And then moving on into instrument, really kind of just teaching basic procedures, following a VOR, you know, just kind of really simple things before we get into the airplane and put all the pieces together. I mean, I think I learn best by like if she shows me how to do it, right? And then I do it, I mimic her, and then I feel like that's how I pick it up best. The simulator is pretty challenging, especially since I don't have a lot of hours. But my instructor has been teaching me a lot, and he's been giving me amazing tips. So I've been learning pretty quickly on it. I, I like it. It's really cool. Like, I don't want to talk about my brother's school, but his doesn't move. His was just like a screen. And he was like, you get one that actually like moves and stuff, all the screens around. I was like, yeah, he's like, that's awesome. So, I mean, it seems pretty great so far. Today, specifically, we were learning uh, steep turns, uh, which is about 45 degrees. And I learned that it's actually pretty steep and it's pretty hard to maneuver, but I'll be practicing that for a while. <laughs> so with the simulators, we have the on off button. We can start the simulator and then start the motion. Um, and then we control everything from an iPad. So I connect to a website and then I can then control weather. I can control the position of the airplane where I want it on the earth, uh, on the ground, in the sky, at a specific airport. Um, I can also adjust um, like failures. So I can fail someone's engine, someone's alternator to kind of go through those procedures as well. I've only been in it twice so far, but yesterday we did stalls. So, uh, you know, going, turning all the way back and then powering up again, and yeah, it was pretty good. 